When and why should you consider ahead the inspections done prior to listing on the MLS? In our area, it's customary to have the buyer pay for inspections. But when would it be advantageous for the seller to have inspections done prior to listing? While we don't always recommend this, here are a few examples as to why inspections can be helpful. It can end up saving you time and money. Hi, I'm Dave with the David Marshall team of VXP Realty. As a seller, you want to be aware of the condition of your property, and we don't want any unexpected costs to come up that you we're not aware of. We've seen sewer line issues cost well over $25,000. Imagine getting a bill for $25,000 for the sewer system and the buyer won't close on the home until this is fixed and paid for. Meanwhile, you're under contract for another home and you need that $25,000 in order to close on that. This would create a huge problem. What about this? Let's say that you're selling your home and you find out that it needs a new roof or a heating system. You could do a few things like sell as is and disclose the issues, not sell at all or get the issues fixed. The idea of getting inspections done prior is to eliminate any potential surprises that could harm you financially later on. We want the seller to be aware of any additional costs that could arise in the home sale. With the inspections, we recommend the standard customary inspections that any reasonable buyer would do. We recommend a general home inspection, a sewer line scope, and radon testing. You will need to pay for this cost up front. While this isn't mandatory, it is helpful to ensure that all health and safety related issues are fixed, including any radon mitigation or sewer line repair. These are common requests from buyers. It also helps the seller because they'll have assurance that they'll actually be able to net the amount that they hope to when they went under contract. It gives them peace of mind that the buyer won't ask for any unreasonable or outlandish repairs. It also encourages buyers to make offers without inspection contingencies. Having inspection Inspections done prior also protects the seller if they have a replacement property to purchase and they need every penny out of their home sale in order to secure and close on the purchase of their new home. The buyer is more confident that they're buying a sound home that's in move and ready condition. Additionally, for some loan programs, the appraiser also acts as an inspector and the lender requires that all health and safety related issues are addressed prior to closing. With these issues already addressed, there's further assurance that the loan will actually go through. Simply put, the seller, the buyer, and and the lender will all have more confidence throughout the entire process that the transaction will actually close. It is in everybody's best interest during the transaction and after the closing. I'm Dave with the David Marshall team at VXP Realty. If you have any questions about inspections prior to listing or anything real estate related, then please contact us for our client-based approach to service excellence.